25, 1866, about a year after the Civil War ended, a group of women visited a cemetery in Columbus, Mississippi to place flowers by the graves of Confederate soldiers who had fallen at Shiloh. As they did, they noticed other graves nearby, belonging to Union dead. But no one had come to visit those graves or place a flower there. So they decided to lay a few stems for those men too, in recognition not of a fallen Confederate or a fallen Union soldier, but a fallen American. A few years later, an organization of Civil War veterans established what became Memorial Day, selecting a date that coincided with the time when flowers were in bloom. By the flow of the inland river, whence the fleets of iron have fled, where the blades of the grave grass quiver, asleep are the ranks of the dead. Under the sod and the dew waiting the judgment day, under the one, the blue, under the other, the grey. These in the robings of glory, those in the gloom of defeat, as with the battle blood gory, in the dusk of eternity meet. Under the sod and the jewel, waiting the judgment day. Under the laurel, the blue. Under the willow, the grey. From the silence of sorrowful hours, the desolate mourners go. Lovingly laden with flowers alike for the friend and the foe. Under the sod and the jewel, waiting the judgment day. Under the roses, the blue. Under the lilies, the grey. So, with an equal splendour, the morning sun rays fall, with a touch impartially tender, on the blossoms blooming for all, under the sod and the jewel, waiting the judgment day, broidered with gold, the blue, and mellowed with gold, the grey. So, when the summer calleth, on forest and field of grain, with an equal murmur falleth the cooling drip of the rain, under the sod and the jewel, waiting the judgment day, wet with rain the blue, wet with rain the grey. Sadly, but not with upbraiding, a generous deed was done. In the storm of the years that are fading, no braver battle was won. Under the sod and the jewel, waiting the judgment day, under the blossoms the blue, under the garlands, the grey. No more shall the war cry sever, or the winding rivers be red. They banish our anger forever when they laurel the graves of our dead. Under the sod and the dew, waiting the judgment day. Love and tears for the blue, tears and love for the grey.